Just want to explain what's happening? Yeah. Uh, we're in the middle of filming extras. Um, done Sam Jackson. There's Dennis. As you know, we've got Kate Winslet, uh, Ben Stiller, um, Ross Kemp, uh, Jude Law. I don't know what Jude Law we, we pulled out a minute ago. Just a little bit annoying. Uh, yeah. He, um, his films went over and um, he's got to do another film. And, he needs some time off, um, so we've just got just got to replace Jude Law, really. So we've got to find an international heartthrob that don't mind making a twat of himself. So it's eight o'clock. Just to try and do it. Luckily, America's a little bit behind us. So what we've done to prepare this, me and Steve, what we did. Steve holding the camera there. That's why I'm looking above the camera. We usually look to the side of the cameraman, but he's about nine foot seven. Uh, what we did to prepare ourselves was. We just got, got fed up and, uh, and had some wine. So we're now we're going to call some <laughs> agents in America. Don't worry about it. Uh, Annika Rice can build a, a house for orphans in a week. I can do this. But I've got Dan Mays' number, who was Ali G's um, producer, Sasha Baron Cohen. I know Sasha Baron Cohen knows people like Brad Pitt, Leonardo DiCaprio. So I'm going to call him up. I haven't spoken to him for a couple of years. But maybe I'd go, hi, how's it going? Remember the Devil Pop show? Give me Leonardo's number. Eight. All that. Answer phone. What should I do? Who is it? Dan Mazer. Oh. Leave a message. Oh. Leave a message. Hi, Dan. Ricky, 11 o'clock show. Can you, uh. I've got Leonardo to cover it now, are you? Oh, for fuck's sake. This isn't going to work. Martin Freeman playing Tim in the office. Can't even get through to Martin Freeman. Answer phone. Forget it. I could phone Jude Law and say, all right, mate, yeah, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. And they go, oh, thanks for being so understanding. But don't you say if you want a holiday or not, mate? You've got the United <laughs> Cuffers number, have you? You'd have thought it'd be the least he could do. Shall I phone him? Shall I phone him and say, oh, oh that's such a shame, never mind. Shall I? May as well. Oh, this is madness. Oh, God. That phase him, wasn't it? He's <laughs> the Well, I'll be honest with you, I think what that means, and he'll just, <laughs> he won't answer it. <laughs> Seriously, though, what are you going to do? Phone Jude Law and say, don't worry about it, but have you got, have you got Leonardo DiCaprio's number? <laughs> oh, he's changed his number? <laughs> oh, God. That is amazing. Oh. <laughs> this, you know what this is like? It's like one of those documentaries about a loser. Who, who, you know what I mean? A who, fantasist. <laughs> <laughs> well, I met him once. Well, I think that I can probably become a director because I have Jude Law's number. But that's just a string of nines. Yeah, his number's nine, 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 nine. That's his number. <laughs> oh, <laughs> there's no evidence that I know any of these people yet. It's not as I can't. <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. Hi, can you go into the study? There's a 2004 blue desk diary. In the back of it, there's loads of different American agents. Okay, I've got the colour on and the size, but let's see the hairs. And the year. Okay, but listen, can you read down the list? Okay, and who's under CAA? Who are the names that are under CAA? Okay, uh, okay, Brad Pitt, yeah. What's Tom Cruise on? Okay, well I've got, I've got, um, Brad Pitt's agency. Right, is he our first choice though? Brilliant. What, you know, you're not sure about Brad fucking Pitt? Okay, fine. No, that, that's, that's, that's fair enough. D don't do this. No, I just, I, no, all I'm saying is I think they're all brilliant, obviously, but I just worry that they're not what we're after at this time. <laughs> Fuck me!
I mean, all around the houses. That's unbelievable. Look, well, what I could put. What you like about this? We're in a hotel. There's <laughs> names dotted around, okay? And. I did that whilst talking to an agent. <laughs> That's my greatest achievement tonight. Nothing. I, got a I can't even get outside the hotel. <laughs> Cannot even get a single. All right, let me quickly look on the internet, see if I can get no, a better oh, bet. Oh, Seriously, man, let, let me check. No way, let me do this. But we'll seem like a couple of gimps. Oh, look, I've been online for 28 minutes. That's going to cost me about 400 quid at these prices. Ah, oh, that's ridiculous. But let me check. Before you unplug it, let me just see if I can get his agent up. I'll do it quickly. Who? Leonardo's. You'll never do it. No, I'll be able to at least find out which agency he's with. He's one of the big ones. Uh, well, according to this is 2001, mm. and it says that up to date. It says that DiCaprio was with Artists Management Group. Right. So at least you can phone them and say, "Is he still with you?" Yeah. There you go. That was four years ago. What sort of c is this? Oh hello. Hello. Oh hello. Could I speak to uh, whoever represents Leonardo DiCaprio, please? Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Did you know who his agent is? Oh, thank you very much. Cheers. Bye. Screen Actors Guild. What's the American 118118? Wait, what? The Screen Actors Guild? Yeah. They mean you have to contact them to find out who's agent yeah. is. Um, is there international inquiries still? International director inquiries? Yeah. We're trying to contact Leonardo DiCaprio via international director inquiries. <laughs> <laughs> the thing is, we don't even know that. We don't even know the number. Oh, oh God, S Steve, how did we get as far as we have? I mean, do you know what I mean? This really is. This is like real life, Lauren and I I'm having trouble getting an outside line. Okay, well, look, phone our director inquiries to get a number for that, for international director inquiries. Okay. And remember, it's not one nine two anymore. Oh. Hello, um, have you got a number for international directory inquiries, please? I need a number for the Screen Actors Guild, please. I'm getting straight through. They put me straight through. Oh, hello. Um, I was given your number um, to try and find out uh, the agent of Leonardo DiCaprio. Would you know that? Thanks. Um, could I speak to um, the agent of Leonardo DiCaprio, please? Thanks. Oh, answer phone. Oh, I can't leave a message, can I? Well, that's pretty good going. What? We got as far as Leonardo DiCaprio's agent, or a, a, or a person who knows his agent. That I consider that the bottom rung of the ladder. Because all we did was phone directory inquiries. We got through that, and I had. To... Come on, this isn't this isn't Gaudoff organising Live Aid, is it? Imagine if we went. That was good. I need one one eight one one eight. Give us your fucking money. Uh, sorry, I'm just, I'm just working a telephone exchange pop. Yeah, Falcon. He's got through to you. I do feel like one of those people that's in a documentary. Going, one, my, one day I will meet Tom Cruise. I'll marry him. And then Coldplay oh. plays a bit. Da -da, da -da, da -da. And it's a picture of me going to the shops like that. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Waste of fucking time.